I'm joined with the head coach of the women's volleyball team, Kelly Hartley Hutton. And coach, first day of practice, how are things going out here? Uh, they're going a little slower than we'd like. I say that we have seven new people, so we have to do a lot of stopping, explaining, and teaching. But that's okay. That's okay right now for the first day. Um, a tournament coming up August 30th, you guys are going to host the IPFW Invitational. Talk about what you're going to focus on between now and then. Um, everything. <laughs> everything. Um, we, again, with seven new people and 17 people on our team, there's a lot of moving parts. So we have to get the most out of every single practice. You know, today and tomorrow probably, um, you know, a little bit of work ethic, a little bit of work ethic issues. And, you know, this is Division One volleyball. Everybody's good. Everybody works hard. So if we want to win in a few weeks, we have to be, we have to be prepared for that. Right now, we're not quite there. Speaking of winning, you guys are defending champions in the Summit League. Are you going to use that as motivation going into this upcoming season? Um, you know, we haven't talked about last year at all yet. Last year's last year. So a different team. We sure enjoyed that run, but it's over. Um, and we know that this year, certainly people know that IPFW puts a good team on the court every year. And I believe we will this year, but we will be young. Two players will get a lot of court time, the reigning player of the year, Emily Spencer, and the lone senior on the team, Jen Milligan. What do you think they bring to the table? Uh, you know, some consistency. Jen Milligan is a very poised player. Um, she's a competitor and, as our only senior, a great leader. Emily's, been, you know, for two years, she's been on the court, six rotations, um, player of the year last year. So, you know, her consistency and, you know, she's just the type of player that brings it. You know, she really plays hard. So as long as she can continue to do that, um, I think we'll get good leadership out of her too.